Hey guys, it's me, Mr. 250, and welcome back to Soma. We're gonna push forward some more. Not too much spook today, but who knows, there could be so much spook in here. Work at a safe distance from well. Recorded downtime, 143 days. So, I'm assuming whatever happened was probably about that long ago. Not going in there. Ah! God. <laughs> Scary ladders. What's going on? I feel like something happens in here. I can't remember. But I hear a lot of heartbeats. Oh. Are you bad? I think you're bad. Yeah, give me the good stuff. Oh, yeah. I have no idea what these are. I think it found me. I think it, found, I think it definitely found me. Time to move. The way to go. If I remember correctly, this is the way to go. Oh god. Okay. I remembered incorrectly. We have to turn off the steam first. It's very conveniently, like right there. Feeling it's about to see me in like 0.3 seconds. Ow! I think he knows where I'm at. I fixed the steam. Steam is no longer a problem. I think he knows where I'm at. Luckily, he's very slow. Ow! <laughs> Yep, now we can go. Unfortunately, it's not an entirely blind playthrough. Yeah! <laughs> it's not going to be an entirely blind playthrough, but after these first, like, I don't know, two hours, I think it will be. Yeah, I think these are I think these are for health. Give me sketchbook. So whoever's been drawing all these things, that might be Amy. Oh, you can turn lights off. Okay. I'd love to check the terminal. But I don't know what the password is. I'm sure it's written down in the room somewhere. Wonder if I can figure out where I where I started and where I went. 
Okay, so I'm here. I went down the stair, or down the stairs into that. No, wait, no. Okay, never mind. I have no idea where I was at. I'm hearing a lot of suspicious noises. Hoping that door holds. Because that's up to communications. Do I want to go up there? I suppose I might want to. <laughs> Yeah, whatever's been happening here has been happening for a while. If having to draw a clothesline in some fancy future under... Under the ocean space base is any indication. You alive? Let me have your memories! Poor Carl. Yeah, let me go ahead and inform my administrator. There's something wrong with my workstation. I've got like pieces of junk lying around. Alright, let's go check out the very obvious, uh... Amy, is that you? What happened to the pilot seat? Robot. I don't know, what what are you? What are you? <laughs> it's me. Carl. Carl Semke. Carl, didn't you die? Angler? Any of this sound familiar to you? I no, actually. Well, thanks for being so helpful. It's not like I'm knocked out on the floor or anything. Carl, it'd be nice if you didn't Hello, have an attitude here. Me? Hello, can you hear me? It's me, Carl, calling from the floor. Are you human? <laughs> My name is Simon. Do you know anything about I this place? I don't think he's a human. Oh, I think he's a robot. You knew. That makes us slightly less weird. Look, I'm obviously hurt. If you see anyone else around, just tell them where I am. You're hurt? You seem to be coming out of the wall. Is that... is that normal? So... where are you, exactly? Are you for real? I'm right here. See me waiting? Look at my hands. Buddy. Okay, okay, I, I'm just, I'm just gonna be, I, I'm not seeing it. I, I see a machine, a robot talking. What the hell are you looking at? I'm here, see? Okay, I, I just didn't expect you to look like that. You're really hung up on appearances, you know that? Might help if you weren't, you know, like a robot or something. So there's a lever here. Auxiliary power. And I can't quite feel it. And I feel like it might kill you. I don't know. Everything. Are you diving in sewage or something? Oh, thanks. Actually, it appears to go back in that room. How did you hurt yourself? Not sure. Blacked out pretty bad. Can't remember how I got here. What do you remember then? I was in the pilot seat, promoting a UH. UH? A universal helper. You know, a robot like these things, but livelier. Anyway, I was just dealing with some heat shields, and that's my last clear memory. I think you don't realize you're still in the, the pilot seat thing. You were remote controlling a robot. We do it all the time. Robots are too on a way to deal with some stuff. 
Intuition doesn't grow on motherboards, you know. Did you maybe get trapped in the robot somehow? Your mind is pretty tightly wired to the helper, but nah, pretty far-fetched. Listen, I don't want to alarm you, but I think you might be trapped <laughs> in a robot. I'm telling you, get your eyes checked. I'm right here. I see both my hands, both my feet. When you remote, all you see is like a video feed from the helper unit. Your own body is entirely out of the picture. So, how many fingers are you holding up right now? <laughs> Two? Go get some help. Find someone who can help. Now, I do remember this. When I was watching someone play this, they never pulled this lever because they were worried it was going to kill him. But I, I'm very curious to see what this lever does. Maybe I should turn it off. Are you okay? Are you okay? Please tell Amy. I need help. I'm sorry. I I think, <laughs> I, think I, pulled I pulled the wrong, wrong lever. lever. Oh, don't sweat it. Just get me a doctor. Oh boy, what a sadistical person I am. I'm sure you'll be fine. Okay, now I feel a little bit bad. Okay, I feel a little bit bad about that. I'm sorry. You okay? Can you hear me? Hello? I think I might have fried a too many a few too many circuits there. Let's get out of here before I feel bad about that. can't open the lever. I wonder, do I have to get into the computer? Maybe? I gotta figure out a password before I can get in, though. So let's check terminal for details, but I need a password. I think it'd be something like a name, like Amy? Or Carl, maybe? Oh, it's a number. It's a number of some sort. I don't really know what number. Something making a lot of noise around here. What is this? I haven't gone this way yet. Maybe there's a password around here somewhere. Oh god, he's dead? He's dead. Hey, Carl. <laughs> You're not over there. You're right here. You're already dead. I wonder if his ID number would be the password. That'd be far too easy, right? Yet that's the only real number clue I've gotten so far, so that might be it. It says read this, but I can't actually read. Though it looks like I might go in here at some point. That's, um... Let me try putting in his ID number, just see if that's it. I think that'd be far too easy. Oh wait, oh, into his mind? There we go. Did he get the final backup turbos going? Everything is wired evenly. We've hedged our bets as much as we possibly can. So that's it. Enough power to run Pathos 2 until the next apocalypse. We're ready to go. I really hope we didn't mess anything up. I don't want to have to come back here again. Relax, it's over. We're going to Theta. Maybe we 
should seal more blocks. I don't trust the helpers to let this place run in peace. We've sealed everything. Everything from the barracks to the comm center. If anyone ever sets their foot here again, they're gonna have a hell of a time getting around. <laughs> So that was just the other thing I heard, but it was more like an extension of that. Alright, let's try the ID. 0722. I doubt it would be something like this. Anyone could log in under your name if that was the case, but let's see. Okay, I guess you can. So that just seems really dumb. Anyone could log in if they'd seen your name badge. Or if you dropped it somewhere. Yeah, not gonna send that. Shut down one of the highlighted sections to divert power to the communication center. Assuming I'm here, this is where the robot guy was. Something in here and then... That was the switch that shocked our friend. Let's see what that did. I opened up storage and somewhere else. You okay, Carl? I'm really sorry about that. I kind of almost feel bad. Yeah, you, you don't actually sound okay. Oh, I'm a terrible person. I even had a chance to like stop and I did it again. <laughs> All right, so this is open now. know about this lever. Touch the thing. <sighs> oh crap. What'd I do? What's up here? Carl was not my fault. Logging under Amy, 0735. That's safe. Let's go log in under Amy real quick. I want to see what it says. Just walking over poor Carl's dead body. Oh, no, never mind. See you later, Amy. We're, we're out. We out of here. Oh, we out of here. I don't need to know nothing about Amy. Uh, I didn't even really consider that there was water coming out of this. And that didn't really seem to work. Well, we're gonna die now. Is he in here? He sounds like he's really close. We're gonna die now. Oh wait, is he walking away? I think he walked away.
Let's pull this lever. It's probably better than whatever else we're doing right now. Do it. Stop the power transfer. I don't think whatever I want is up here. Not anymore now. Which means we gotta go back in that room. We might have to pull that lever again. really is not a very big room. Like, I don't have a lot of room to walk around him or anything. Hide in the locker? No. Which way is he going? Is he coming up here? No, I think he's going back. This is what you get for going to the crazy doctor of mind control. You get freaky dreams like this. This is entirely your fault. He's not even a real doctor. He probably gave you the, the craziest drugs. Please don't tell me you're coming back down here. Just waddle, waddle somewhere else. coming back? Come on! Oh, maybe I gotta hide back here. This makes sense. I gotta wait for him to come down the hallway. Probably. Maybe not. Not it. Dang it. I don't really know where else to go other than flip the lever again. But I think he's dead. So I flipped the lever, I don't have to feel bad. Not anymore, anyway. We'll find out. Yeah, he's dead. So auxiliary power's flowing. And I don't feel bad anymore because he's dead now and he can't scream. I was pretty bad, I don't know. See, I didn't care and then he started screaming and I felt really bad about that. I think he's down the hallway. It's not it either. Actually, this is not where I really want to be either. Did he break through down here? I did see him kind of marching his way up. Yeah, he did. He broke through down here. Or he opened it or something. I don't know. I 
don't know what level of intelligence this thing has. Okay, I think he's going in this room now. This lever absolutely doesn't work, but I am putting auxiliary power in now for something. I don't really know where that goes. I think the map probably explained it, but I don't really have a good chance to look at it right now, obviously. I noticed me flipping the lever flip this to, like, stop. Yeah, stop power transfer. So that's locked, so can't really do anything with that. So I wonder if this is working now. Hmm, not really. don't really know what I'm supposed to do. The only things I could really do are flip that lever, which it's now kind of locked position. I can flip the other lever, which I did. I could try to log in under Amy, but I think it's all real time, so I'm probably going to get, like, clobbered while I'm, you know googling Amy on the internet. God. Hmm. I mean, this lever's definitely locked now. I shouldn't have pulled the lever. That was a bad, bad decision on my part. Probably. I think that room back there in the corner might be open now. Yeah, this room's open now. Let's see what's over here. <laughs> I don't do well with these horror games. What did that say? There's something in there. Observe your overall condition, measures a wide range of data, it relates to Pathos Warden Unit. Some sort of injection. I guess I want that. Maybe? Do I want that? I don't know what this thing is, but it seems important. Designed to observe your condition. I don't really see how that can help. Unless there's like some kind of auto injection thing maybe I need. I don't know. I feel like this is important. Maybe this is something Carl needed. Maybe logging in under Amy's thing will give me more information. 
but I don't remember her login, so I gotta go back and get it. To save us a little bit of time, I think I'm just gonna edit me going over there and stuff so we don't have to waste as much time crouch walking around. So that's 0735. So I need to remember that. Oh crap, this is gonna be iffy. I think he saw me. I think he definitely saw me. Ah! <laughs> I'm not here. Do not look behind these suspicious boxes in the suspicious corridor of the hallway. He definitely saw me, but I may have gotten away from him due to his stupidity. <laughs> that was a little bit close. So you're 735. I may have like implanted the number into my head and just in fear. I don't know if that'll do anything. Gonna... I don't know if it can see me while I'm here browsing the computer, but I'm... I, I feel kind of nervous browsing it, like, <laughs> while he's just kind of stomping around the room. So, he appears to have, like, a three-point system. He goes over here, and he goes into that room, and then he walks that way. I'm gonna wait until he walks into this room, and that should give me, I don't know, like, 30 seconds of peace of mind, maybe? Of course, he might not be able to see over here at all. So we might be entirely safe. Yeah, we'll try that. So I can get back into the power thing. I did have to shut off some things. Well, he sure gets stompy when he wants to. Palm area should be open now. Let's see if it is. Yes. Get me out of here. This place is terrible and I don't want to live here anymore. Where's the lever? Shut this thing before this idiot comes out. Yeah. <laughs> now he'll never know I escaped. They're talking about a domed place. I think this is it. After a hundred something days of water leaking, surely this thing should be full of water, right? Unless it's just like leaking into the lower areas. Good luck with the apocalypse. Just 
stomping around down there. Who actually does like these big push pin and string or yarn things like that? I hope he doesn't know I came up here. He might be a little bit upset and open the door. <sighs> what was that? Oh. Just spooky sounds. We are very far in the future right now. different installations which uh, we saw like a basic list we saw well we saw a list of it whenever it was those radio control things or something this place is really falling apart and uh, I guess I think it's some kind of like apocalyptic apocalyptic underwater base thing maybe mentioning uh, the apocalypse somewhere over here I think good luck with the apocalypse yeah maybe the zombies broke out and then they're, now there's zombie robots oh just paying attention to the time now it looks like that's about all I'm gonna do for today but I hope you enjoyed pre-recording some of these yet again um, there's supposed to be some bad weather coming through this weekend because of a hurricane so there's a decent chance that my internet might go out, so I'm going to try to get all these done ahead of time. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for some more Soma. Bye!